All right, let's do this. Okay, Wait, so not yet, not yet, not yet, not, not yet, yet, not yet. <laughs> the Takis. Takis are seriously intense. Oh my god. <laughs> Takis are C tier. <laughs> what? Takis are S tier. I hate spice. I'm too white for it. Like, I literally cannot eat anything spicy. Like, even stuff that's not spicy is too spicy for me sometimes. I want to get it out of the way first. I think Stereo Madness through Dry Out is just like C or D tier. Like, they're not bad, but they're, they're kind of... Back then, gameplay, like... You couldn't really make interesting and easy gameplay, in my opinion. Like, there just wasn't enough to I think do that. Polar Geist. I think Polar Geist was decent. I think Polar Geist was like a B. Really? Polar Geist is probably the best of the four. Alright, I won't argue. I'm willing to do that. What's our average? C or D? Average is C. Alright. <laughs> base after base, I think is B tier, personally. Base you might disagree. Base? I nah. I remembered it badly. I played through it again and it wasn't that bad. I I, I can I can agree to C tier though. They're all C tier. These levels are all gonna be like C or some of the there, are, there, are, there are some awful ones though. We'll get to those in a second. Yeah. Base after base, though, I think high C tier, in my opinion. Yes, that's fair. Can't let go sucks. No, e. That's it, pretty harsh. It's so bad, dude. Okay, I'll move to I mean, I, I don't e. like this level. Yeah, because, yeah, E is, e is reserved for Jumper. Jumper. What? I hate Jumper, but I, I don't nah, have a reason a. why. Hey, <laughs> this level is bad. What do you mean? Dumper is an A tier. That level slaps. It's it's like. No, it doesn't. It slaps. Why, dude? <laughs> it's fun. I don't know. The music is. This like is the most. The music. The music's great. But this was like the most annoying level to beat. Because because I'm, I'm trying surprised. to think of it like. I'm trying to think of it like if you're a new player and like starting out and progression wise, this level is annoying. I beat Jumper before Can't Let Go, which I mean, Can't Let Go sucks too, but Jumper's a banger. I'll move it Jumper's up to like, D, but I'm not going any higher. Yeah. Jumper stands. Oh my god. Okay, that's fair. But Jumper stands by its name. It's a good level to jump to, it's an easy level to jump to. A time Machine. I, I'm curious on what your opinion is of Time Machine. I like Time Machine. You like it? I can't decide I because I, I like it. It's an A tier. I think it's an A tier time machine. It, I kind of agree, but I don't. I can't explain why. It may be high, high B. Are you going with B? Yeah, I'm thinking B because yes. I feel like I want to put other levels in A tier. Yeah, me too. Me too. I have a couple. A couple of good ones are coming up. Cycles. Which apparently used to be rated insane, which I think is fair, because Cycles is pretty... Like, I think Cycles is harder than X-Dub. Uh-huh. No, actually. I'm not sure about that. I'd have, I'd have to play them again, but... Well, yeah, I was I playing them, Cycles Cycles was like, out of... I, like, one attempted basically all the levels for Electrodynamics. Cycles took me, like, ten. Maybe it is harder. Who knows? But I think it's I'd good. I think cycles. it's good, but, like, yeah. Low B. Hello, Polar Ghost. X-Dub... I oh, think this is. I think this is, like I think this is an A tier level. This is really good. It's yeah, a really. You know what? It might be S tier. We got our first S tier boys. Yeah, we do. S dude, clubs or X step is, I think like, the perfect difficulty jump. And it should have been where cycles is. I think. I think X step should have come after time machine, and then cycles after X step. <laughs> Such a fun level to jump to. It is. Right after it, you it is very fun, and it's like. Cycles and X Step are the first two levels that like actually require you to like have good ship control. Well, not good, but like the ships and all the levels leading up to them are so easy. And then they start getting hard, and that's fun because like the ship yeah. gameplay and all the other levels was super boring. And it's the first level I think with actually unique gameplay because it has um you know that one ship part with the yeah the, the upside down pads. yeah that, that's cool and it, it's cool because like you can survive that but like. That's like the yeah, swag you route. Just, like, bounce, you can just bounce on them. It's fun. Yeah. I mean, it'll kill you like 90% of the time, but it's funny. 
I don't know if this is a hot take or not. I don't like Clutterfunk. I don't think it's that bad. It's like a low B. It's I would put it. Good. I would put it low C, actually. What? I don't the like it. The gameplay's not great. Of the grand gameplay's not amazing, but it's it's also it's like, like iconic. It's crazy hard for its time, like for for where it was, like. Yeah, it this is, level actually, it takes, took you kind of a while. Like I found this much harder than Theory of Everything in Electrodynamics. I'd say it's probably the third hardest insane level of all the Rob Top levels. But I'd put it under uh, Dynamics and Hexagon Force. Yeah, I think Lucy's. I, I do remember. Wrong. I remember at the time, a lot of people, um, when they beat it, they were really excited because it was such a hard level at the time. Yeah. Now it's nothing, but you know, at the time. Uh, what do you think of Theory of Everything? It's, I think it's an A tier. A tier? Okay, I was I was worried because I agree. I love Theory of Everything. That's good, but it's, it doesn't quite compare to X Step. X Step is a. Is it a doesn't. Tier. I, I the, the thing with Theory of Everything is I feel like I like it because I have weird gameplay tastes. So I'm always worried to say that I love the level because like I also yeah. think the level is like uh. Like, I think your nostalgia's gameplay slaps, even though it's kind of crap sometimes. This this level I have so much biased about. Electro Man Adventures, uh, I love- it's my favorite song of all of the main level songs. And it's why I want to put the level in A tier, but I don't know if it goes there. I think it's a good level, but the gameplay- some of the gameplay is kind of It's kind of boring, is the problem. I just like the song too much. I, I can kind of agree. I'd have to play it again, but I can kind of remember. I, I don't know. I think it's like a B. B? I'll put it above Time Machine. Club Step. Oh! Banger. Banger, S. really? I think it's S. overrated. S. You think? I don't put think it it's S. Right I can put it put in it up A. There right now. Put it up there no, it's right not right S now. tier. Come on. There's nothing much There's else a, to be said. It's just, dude, an, it's just an S. It has off screen gameplay. It has, there's what, I remember there's this one bug in the level, you. where you Skill can die. You. No, it's not. Bro, this level has flow problems towards the end. If it, held the, if it held the same quality throughout the whole thing, uh, I'd probably agree with you. But like, after 50%, I think it starts to dip. What? What this do you mean, guy... what? Nah, I mean... Nah, I, I can't, I can't agree. I cannot agree. All right, we'll agree top of A for now, or bottom of S. Okay, we'll we'll just go with A. Electrodynamics. Right. This is the worst Rob Top level. Shake. First F. That might be our first F. This it's level not... is so annoying. Yeah, it's like <laughs> the ending is hard to read, so it's, it's like so weird. Yeah, play. you have to like dip down and go up way earlier than it looks like you should. And also like at the end, at the end, there's these um, four spike jumps, which are not easy to read unless you practice the level. So it's just not a fun yeah. level to straight, straight read. Like yeah. it's not hard, but it's it's harder than it feels. At first. Yeah, it it and it, it like the ship control in it is kind of crazy. <laughs> like the ship <laughs> control time, in this level crazy. is is much harder than Club Step. I think Rob Top redeemed himself with Hexagon Force. Because Hexagon, Hexagon Force is an S. Is an Hexagon S. Force yes. is an S. Yes, it's we agree. S. That's so my, good. That's, how, that's my favorite um, Rob Top level, at, also. Yeah, he Hexagon Force, S. I think, is in my top three or four. Blast yeah. Processing is a banger. I think it's we like can a agree a S. High A. High A? S. Okay. I A or S? I don't know, man. I'd say bottom of S. I like last yeah. thing. It is. It is a great, great way to introduce the wave. Everyone was having so much trouble with it. I remember at first. You know, yeah, remember the wave. Decode? I remember. Remember, people thought the decode wave was impossible. Yeah. Great introduction. You have Anyways. everything too. I think, in my opinion, this is the best level in the game. I'm almost. Yeah, I okay. almost want to make S plus tier and put it there. It's so much fun. Yeah, it's fun. It's an S tier. Yeah, this is this is my like. I'm frustrated with the game. I want to play something challenging and fun. I I always go to theory of everything too. 
I, a lot I, of levels branched off of Theory of Everything do a lot of yeah. levels branched off of it. Yeah, a lot of really good ones. I think this is the most underrated Rob Cup level, is Dominator. I think people don't like the memory part, even though it's not a memory part, and it tells you where to go if you like pay attention. Dominator, yeah. it's way it literally too has glowing stuff that shows where the where where the blocks yeah. are. It's it gets so much undeserved hate. I legitimately think this is an eight tier level. Solid A. I'd say it's like, I don't know. Just put it anywhere in there. <laughs> My God, I want to put this level in S so bad, but I can't. I can't put Deadlocked in S because it has a lot of bugs. Oh yeah, uh, Deadlock is for, for me. Deadlock is a B. I I know. I love. I feel so good playing this level, especially you know the robot part with like all the rainbow blocks. That part yeah. feels so cool to play. It's got like one of the best parts of the song added too. It's a very well made level. I disagree. I think the gameplay makes. I mean, I think the decoration and the gameplay makes absolutely no sense. Like you literally go from like an acid. Oh, the theming! The theming is bad. Don't get me wrong. The, the theming, theming sucks. The theming is horrible, and it makes it a bad level. Just for its first time, it's a, not a good level. I mean, first time it was well made, but it doesn't have a theme at all. I, I love just, actually. I want to go with B. I want to go with B. I w I love playing this level, but I'm gonna concede B tier. Yeah. I put it above. I put it at top of B though because I do kind of like it. And then. Finger Dash, which I think has probably pretty solid theming, if I'm remembering it correctly. It has solid theming, but it's boring. It's it's, so it's boring. boring. It's boring for how much gameplay it has. Honestly, B. B tier? Really? That's B. actually kind of. I thought you were gonna put it lower. Um, or maybe even C. It, it's not very good in my opinion. Like it's it's objectively nice, but it's boring. It's really yeah. boring. I'll put it above base after base. I see. I think Yo, there's actually, so much, there's so many mechanics in 2.1 that got added, and they were used really basically in this level. Yeah. To the point where it, it almost feels like a 2.0 level. It okay. shouldn't. Yeah. That's the spider, um, the second spider in the level is actually like, it's actually hard for the introduction of the level. Yeah. Uh, the introduction of the game mode too, so. Yeah. So it's literally like, it literally goes in like one block spaces. Just kind of. I mean, it's not very hard now, but at the time, that was kind of insane for yeah. a new game mode. Yeah, Finger Dash is not very good, but, you know. I don't think we had an easier level. No levels were, like, exactly this bad. Yeah, I think Electro Dynamics would fit in E, technically, but... Yeah, we're gonna go with the F. We're gonna put one in the F, just so we have one in there. I hate Electro Dynamics. I think, because I also think there's a sizable gap between Electro Dynamics and these two levels. Yeah, in my opinion. there is. Electro Dynamics is also just like the decoration is kind of messy in some it's parts. It's really weird. It, it doesn't look good. Some parts are kind of cool, but F. Yeah. L. Wait, we should have an L tier instead. We should have had an L tier. L. Let's go. Instead of the E. Yeah, let's go. Perfect. L plus uh -oh. ratio. This is an incredible uh, tier yeah. list. I'm going to DM this to Rob Cup on Twitter. You won't be very happy about Finger Dash. <laughs> you, you won't be happy about Finger Dash. No, he's not. Gonna. This is a good list. Good, good yeah, list. Totally, totally unbiased. Unbiased. I'm sure, can, I'm, I'm sure all of you can agree on all of these placements. Yes. Especially with the placement of Electroman Adventures. Unbiased. Where can the people find you, Turbo? Turbo868. Wait, no, Turbo I actually changed I actually changed it. Now yeah. it's impossible. Now it's impossible to find. It's just turbo. So now you'll it's never impossible never find him. Find. Yeah, you'll, you'll never, never find him. him. Alright. Good list. I think we can wrap that up.